Welcome my friends to another Minecraft Dungeon Build Guide video here and as you know you can customise your character in all sorts of crazy ways in Minecraft Dungeons and we are centering this build around the Soul Dancer robe to allow you to get a whole load of souls to power your artefacts and fight off loads of mobs. As you can see by the gameplay there's some really powerful artefacts here and let's just jump straight on into the details, not waste any time and show you all what you need to make this build for yourself so first things first you want the soul dancer robe which is a unique robe this armor is awesome and it gives you plus 305 health 30% chance to negate hits which is nice but the main thing here is that it allows you to gather souls super quickly so plus 100% souls gathered so you're basically doubling the speed which you gather souls from enemies and plus 50% artifact damage. So the awesome artifacts, which we're going to talk about in a second, such as the Corrupted Beacon, it will give it a 50% damage boost, which is incredible. And you can see here, we've also got an enchantment, which also helps us out. And this one is called Soul Speed. And basically this armor enchantment provides a small speed boost when you gain souls from mobs so that's pretty cool we're using the souls here to our maximum ability in this build next thing you want is the feral soul crossbow and it's got quite a slow fire rate as you can see there by the speed bar but it is unique it has a souls critical boost which is nice and it gives you plus two soul gathering so again this allows you to gather souls even quicker to power up your artifacts which is what we're all about here and if you look down in the enchantments you can see we've got anima conduit engaged there and this basically heals you a small percent when you absorb a soul so not only are you gathering souls with this crossbow it's also giving you health and healing you so we're using souls to the absolute maximum here next up you want the torment quiver and why do you want that well you may have noticed in the gameplay basically this is an insanely powerful arrow which fires back mobs and it is super powerful because of all the energy it releases which pushes back waves of mobs it gathers plus one soul and it also requires souls to power it so pretty good because it will keep powering itself and it only has a one second cooldown so you can use this very very quickly and the last piece here that is really worth mentioning i mean i know we do have up in the top here we've got the soul knife which isn't really worth talking about the only thing that's really good here again about this is it also has plus two soul soul gathering sorry which allows you to power up your artifacts again but what we really want to talk about is just down there in the artifacts you can see we've got the corrupted beacon again which is amazing as it does 69 artifact damage per second it also gathers plus one souls and it requires souls to power it but remember we are also getting that 50 percent buff from our soul dancer robe so that is what you need for this build it's super awesome now just sit back and check out the beam there taking out all of these mobs really really useful when there's large crowds and then when we go on to the next clip you can see how effective this crossbow is at pushing mobs back you can see like the blue like tailwind off it it's super awesome hopefully you enjoyed this let me know down below in the comments what you want me to do my next build on. Subscribe for all things Minecraft Dungeons coming your way here on the channel and we'll see you on the next one my friends.